Last time on Fallout New Vegas. Am I high? Yo, 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 Flem. I sure hope that explosion was you. Did you seal off the sulfur? Yep. Good to hear. Without access to the sulfur, Cook doesn't have much to offer the gang. I... I guess it's over then. We can turn ourselves in. Hmm. Hey guys, Boney McBonerton here, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. In this episode, we're doing even more exploration. That's right, what will we find? Hell if we know, probably Vault 11. But first, now uh, let's go to Black Rock Cave. Why not? No, 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 no. Okay, let's see if we can, uh... Yeah, it's right over here, actually. Okay, I'm carrying dynamite. That's a good thing to know. So, luckily, I've tried to rework around the mod that was supposed to give me a level cap at 100. Because the last time it just was not working. So that way we can get a lot of perks and even get our skills all the way up. Now keep in mind, I want to say this. The vanilla game is only at level 50. Meaning that you cannot get to level 100 without mods or console commands. Just, just want to put it out there. For some of you guys that are slow. Yeah, the Black Rock Cave should be here somewhere. Right about here, actually. Hello? Okay, dead coyote, that's assuring. Hello? Oh my god, Nightkin! Guys, guys! You know... I love when I throw an explosion and their immediate response is JUMP IN FRONT OF THE EXPLOSION! Ooh. God, that was scary. All right, come here, my pack mules. Let's distribute the weight. Pin down. Okay, fine. What? Whatever. Uh, Veronica. You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Yes. Hey, I can't. I'm sure you. Sure. Just don't treat me like a pack brahmin, okay? I I'm going to. I'm not gonna lie. I am. Really going to. Oh. Ah, mine now. Wait, Paladin Toaster, hold on. Oh, this is a unique weapon. Oh, and drugs. Give me, give me the drugs. Ah, what the heck? Uh, drop this. So yeah, this is a unique weapon that deals EMP damage to robots and people wearing power armor. It, it's pretty okay. Okay, it's pretty good. I mean, as long as you're fighting the Brotherhood of Steel. Hence the name, Paladin Toaster. And in really good condition too, alright. Well, now that we've got that, on to Vault 11. You'll also notice that I'm actually intentionally avoiding other areas. Well, that's because we will soon discover those areas as we're going through the main quest line. Let's see, it should be up here.
Ah, here it is. Okay. Good to know that the mod did not work. We are still stuck at level 50. Ew, scorpions. Ew. You nerd. Sorry guys. Sorry you're staying outside. Okay. Now I'm having some flashbacks to Fallout 3. Well, except for these political posters. And I'm over encumbered again. Cool. Did you guys open up the door? God damn it. Okay, they opened the door. Okay. Come here. That's Raul. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go through the door. Rumors about Haley are baseless. Vote Stone for Overseer. Haley is known adulterer and communist sympathizer. Elect Haley for Overseer. I hate. Anything moves, it's gonna get it. God, look at all these political posters. My God, it feels like 2016 in here. Except 90% of it's not Orange Man bad. They even have a classroom. Grandmama? Hold on a minute. Oh god, please stop saying it like that. That's terrifying. Oh, that's the problem. I've got too much ammo. Fifty-six missile. Why do I have fifty-six missiles? What the fuck? Huh, public terminal. Vault eleven election guide. Education democratic process and the bedrock upon which continual eleven based. Blah 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 blah. Notice a postponement. Investigation of murders, Jesus. Okay. Wait, hold on. I might actually need that back. Grandmama, I need something. Oh god, we talked about this, Grandma. That's scary. I don't like it. Reloading. Okay, Wait, no, I'm out. Ew. Mantis. Come on, man. I just want the beer. Okay, that's a weird dead end hallway. You guys are what the fuck? Oh, oh, ooh. There's dead people on the table. Well, I mean, technically skeletons, but still, still, my god. Rat.
That's right. Get under there, you animal. Ew. What's going on? Okay, well, let's not go down there yet. No, actually, hold on. You know what? Here, uh, give me the bumper sword, actually. Uh. Let's deal. Okay, I did not give you the bumper sword, but I gave you a lot of unique weapons. My God. You're making me carry the heavy stuff, aren't you? Here, I'll trade you bumper sword for love and hate. There. Come on, you gotta admit, a giant fucking sword. This is cool. Ah, another set of stairs. Hmm, same thing. Rat! Oh my god! Ah! That thing launched at my fucking face like a demented pogo stick! My god! That was terrifying! No. Wait. No, no one touched that computer. Give me a sec. Okay, so that's just a trap. Same thing. Pardon me. Dang, no, I must have imagined that. Living quarters. And I just heard a rat die. Ooh. Hmm. Lunchbox. A lot of neat stuff here. I'm not gonna lie. And a lot of vision batteries. My god. Ooh. Rat. Please, just, just stop. Okay, what was, what were those things called? Fission batteries. Right, 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 right. Didn't your mother ever tell you it's polite to help an old lady carry her bags? I'm sorry, Grandmama. Done. Disengage lock. Ooh. Ooh. Hello, darling. Good to see you. And 13. Ooh. There's so much good shit in here. Oh my god. Okay, anyone have free uh, inventory space? Ganon? Yes, sure. you do. Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin. I, I'm okay. going to. We we both know I am. There. Another terminal, what's on it? Security terminal. Disposition. Position defending Catherine Stone by Vault Attorney General Mouse. Okay.
goes him. Mm hmm. Okay, interesting. Uh, ooh, more ammo. Eh. Yeah, probably. Hey, look, whiskey. Alright, let's keep going. Overseer office. What the? Who rigged this shit up? Come on, man. Come on. Fucking I swear, man. Fire's key. Oh. Treat me like a pack Brahmin. We've, okay? we've been over this, man. There we go. Whew, that's a lot of weight off me. Okay, so that's rubble. Atrium. Oh my god. Ooh! Bug! Okay, you guys got it. What the f Oh my god. Who did that? Who did that? Who fucking set that mine off? Oh, water. There's a chair, a locker, differential pressure control. Uh, I don't know what the fuck this thing is, but I'm taking it. Come on. Yeah. Don't drink the- Oh, you fucking- I told you not to drink the water, but you're like, Mmm, tasty water. It tastes so- It tastes so good when it makes my tongue bleed. Mmm, so scrumptious. Yeah. Oh, bug, bug. You know, at this point, I'm just keeping my weapon out. Oh, we're getting some rads here. Oh, it's this water. Ew. Ooh, 
Coffee cup. Ooh, coffee cup. Wait, let's keep ex let's keep exploring down here. Okay, not there just yet. Okay, let's put on the rebreather. Because I know this is getting on someone's nerves. Anything moves, it's gonna get it. Ooh. Whoa! Ooh, that's weird. Ugh. Oh my god, ooh! Oh, you crippled my leg, you dick! Hold on, hold on. Ah, that's better. What the? Okay. Password is Betty, really? Terminal having the systems of Alt 11. God damn, this is a long ass speech. My god. Man, these are really weird political posters. Especially this one. Justice block. What's the blog? I don't know, I might be having a stroke. I mean, I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, come on. When am I not having a stroke? Uh-oh. Here we go. What? Ow! You dick! Fucking going through doctor's bags like they're fucking candy. Fuck this, I'm putting on my, uh... Valiance, or whatever the hell it's called. Mm, toaster. Okay. Who tried to stuff a dead mantis in the fridge? Ooh, fresh water. A lot of food. Oh my god, yes. All of it. More ammo. Kind of a bad place to put a lantern, though. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Alright, pack mules. I need you. No, fuck it. I'll eat food. Oh, wow. That's actually really helpful. Hmm, ant nectar. The miracle fruit. You know, assuming it's a fruit. Ah, top of the atrium. Guess I'll get on this one. Ugh. 
come on. Well, back up it seems. Well, that did nothing. Fuck all, if anything. Man, they made this place harder to navigate than Mongolian prison. Hey, I assume it wouldn't be easy. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, we already looked through those. It's good. Utility, yeah, we've been through utility. We just need to get to the overseers. Ah, overseer's office. Alright, I got the password. Open sa sacrificial chamber. Um guys? Guys, listen, I uh wait here. Oh, I'll be here. Just don't expect me to fend off a gang of super mutants while you're gone. Hey, you keep your fantasies out of this, okay, Ganon? Sheesh, you fucking sicko. I'll hold up here. Don't be long. Alright, uh, Veronica? Should've brought something to read. Yeah. Okay, boss. Grandmama? Where's Grandma? Oh, there you are, Grandma. Grandma, I need you to wait here. Stay where Grandma can see you. I'm, I'm sorry, but I gotta go to what's called the Sacrificial Chambers, um... I'm just gonna bring a beaten glove just to be sure. Oh, that's assuring. Congratulations, martyr. Your fantastic journey is only just beginning. Please proceed to the light. Okay. The light is calming and puts your mind at ease. Go to the light. Oh my god, my fucking eyes! Ow! Ow! Fuck! Turn off all these fucking flood lamps! Welcome. Please sit in the chair. The show is about to begin. Okay, this... I don't know about this. Um, Let's see, we got... Ow, we got an empty whiskey? Uh, fuck. This chair is disgusting. Oh my god, you know, fine, listen. That's not the show requires that you sit in the chair. I don't want to. Oh, fine, I'll sit down. Greetings, martyr, and welcome. If you're here now, it means you've been offered up as a sacrifice so that your vault can continue to thrive. Currently, you may be feeling sad or angry. Perhaps you never got to have grandkids, or to enjoy the pleasures of a fresh cigar. But march with your chin held high, soldier, and remember that each of us has an important role to play. For some people, their role might be to heal the sick. For others, it might mean they will drive a race car, or fly a rocket ship. And some of us are meant to forfeit our lives for the good of the people. Sure, it might not be as fun as driving a race car, but it's every bit as important. Let's take a moment to reflect on the moments that made your life worth living. Think about that time you kissed your steady girl for Never the happened. time under the bleachers at the big game. Or when you snuck out after curfew to catch that new flick that your parents wouldn't let you see because it was too scary. Boy, were they right. Never happened. And who could forget when you met the love of your life? Never happened. What a looker. These are just examples. Do you feel that feeling stirring in your chest as you think of these things? Yes, it's regret. Good. What you are feeling is peace. You've led a great life. Living it has been its own reward. But it is only the beginning. Close your eyes now. And imagine what joys await you in the next life. The afterlife. Can you see them? Good. <laughs> what? What the fuck? Oh, what the shit! What the shit! 
Oh god, I hate the afterlife! It sucks! This sucks! Ow, my fucking arm! Get back here, you little bitch! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh, oh no! Okay, where's that one drug I love? Hydra, store limb condition, that's not it. God, what was it called? And one just to be safe, uh, turbo! Oh, there we go! Now what, you little bitch? that everyone? Oh, not you. Yes, in case you were wondering, yes, turbo slows down time. And apparently the menus too. Whew. Alright, let's fix myself up. Ugh! What the fuck? That was terrifying! My god, they really want want to whoever in such they really want whoever sits in that chair dead. They had like five turrets here, five turrets there, two fucking sentry bots and a protectron just for safe measure and a These are a lot of skeletons. My god. Hey, what up you little computerized bitch? Right and complete. Congratulations, citizens of Vault 11. You have made the. All right, I know you can hear me, so listen up. There's five of us left. Five out of I don't know how many. Wait, hold on. So, congratulations, citizens of Vault 11. You have made the decision not to sacrifice one of your own. You can walk with your head held high, knowing that your commitment to human life is a shining example to us all. And to make that feeling of pride even sweeter, I have some exciting news. Despite what you were led to believe, the population of Vault 11 is not going to be exterminated for its disobedience. Instead, the mechanism to open the main vault door has now been enabled, and you can come and go at your leisure. But not so fast. Be Either sure way. to check with your overseer to find out if it's safe to leave. Here at Vault Tech, right, your safety is our number one priority. Oh, shit. Alright, I know you can hear me, so listen up. There's five of us left. Five out of I don't know how many. So, it's over. We've talked and it's over. We're not gonna send anybody to die anymore. So shut off our water, our gases, or do whatever it is you're programmed to do. But we're done listening to you. And so they defy. So the goal of this is a vault experiment. Ooh, female dorm. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I got distracted. Besides, there's no one alive here anymore. As I was saying, the goal of this vault experiment was to get them to defy their robot overlord ish in order to value human life. And in doing so, it would have actually freed them. Still looking. That's kind of Still looking. fucked up. Like, at one point, you'd have to ask, hey, what if they don't? What if they're too scared and they obey the machine? Yeah, obviously this whole, uh, plan of theirs did not go well.
Fuck it, I'll eat some food. Okay, I'll go out and eat, sure. There we go, that should do it. Hey guys, call me Jake Paul because I just tased a fucking rat to death. No, wait, wait, wait. When Jake Paul did it, the rat was already dead. So, um, yeah, make of that a what you want. Who's spoon along alone? Fuck me. Come on. Ah, this is taking forever. Come on. Outer paths. Hey, outer paths. Security recording. Download complete. She can't do this. It's done. We're done. Nothing's done. She's got the authority. The only thing she can't do is change her own fate. Nothing says she can't change the selection process for future overseers. I say she can't. You shouldn't have toyed with her like that, Roy. We still have the majority. We don't vote for anything anymore. I'm not talking about voting. What then? You want to have a sit-in? A hunger strike? Not exactly. Maybe march into her office with torches and pitchforks? Yes. Come on. I mean it. What? Start a revolution? Laws don't outlast their governments. Roy, all we have to do is wait until someone from Justice Block gets picked for Overseer. Then we have them change the law back. There won't be any blocks after the new Overseer is picked tomorrow. Everyone's going to move on. By the time we've reformed, who knows if we'll still be in the majority. We can hold the block together. Oh. You don't know that. Besides, what if the computer picks you? What if it picks me? And your solution is to start shooting. Not if you don't have to. Look, we arm up. We go to the lower floors, take some strategic targets. Power, food, water. Just until she turns authority over to us. The other blocks won't support it. They're tired of us having the power. We have the majority. We don't need them. This isn't a vote, Roy. They'll fight back. They've never had the nerve. Hell of a way to test it. Two, three... Four. Are we really gonna do this? It's open. We could just leave. I couldn't. Not after that. We don't deserve to leave. A shining example. That's what it called us. But we were. We did what we were supposed to. Not by a long shot. Anybody would have done what we did. You ask me? That's exactly the problem. Now let's get on with this. I'll go first. Wait, wait. People should know what happened. They could learn from it. If there's anyone out there at all, I hope they never have to find out. Ready, Harry? Yeah. No, 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 wait! <sighs> so that's what happened. This is... This place is fucked up. I hate it. I hate it. This is messed up. This is like so fucking screwy. Like seriously. My. My God. Yeah. Let, let's. Let's get out of here guys. Come on. Come on. Everyone out. Everyone out of this fucking nightmare vault. Come on. Everyone out. You too Graham. Graham. You too, Grandma Ma. Come on. Everybody out. 
gonna close this shit up forever. Fuck that. No, seriously, just just fuck that, dude. That's not okay. Ugh. Ugh. That voice kind of sounded familiar, I'm not going to lie. Oh, well. Well, this was Boney McBonerton here with Fallout New Vegas, episode 82. In the next episode, we'll probably do more exploring. But to where, that is the good question. Let's see, Hoover Dam Ranger Station came for them. Oh, uh, yeah, this place looks good. Where to go next? Let's see, we've explored a lot of what's over here. Yeah, we'll go there in the next episode. As for now, have a good day now, and goodbye.